hello friends welcome back to the new tutorial of uh, ubuntu so today we are going to learn about how to install redis cache in ubuntu so let's get started those who haven't subscribed my channel yet please do subscribe my channel and if you like the video please do like share and comment on it so let's get started so to install the redis there are the commands that i have listed down so first of all you need to write this command sudo apt update so go to the terminal and uh, exist this cd i'm going to run this command so you need to add this sudo apt update okay so moving to the next part we need to install the redis cache with the help of the sudo apt install redis server Yes. Done. Now you need to open this file. And here we have the supervised. So you need to check it out. This is a bind example, so you can bind the local host with any of the port also. So here it is a bind with the local host. You can see that bind with local host only. And there is a port protect mode. TCP timeout. Is it this is supervised? Supervised is no. Let me check or others command is there or not. In search with the W, control W, and the search with the parameter supervised. Okay. So there is only one parameter here, so it is supervised. You need to add it over here. What we have to add that is supervised system MD. Okay. So copy this and uh, just paste it okay control o control a control enter wrote control x okay moving to the next step we have to go with this one we need to check restart the ready service okay next we need to check the status of the redis it is what the active status or not let's see so you can see that it's green so it's active now you need to we can disable this redis cache with the help of the disable now we are going going with the redis cli and check the connection it is working or not this is this uh, this this the steps are basically for installing now we will check the command whether the redis cache is working or not so if you get the ping that means let's have a look on that redis cli okay so first of all we will check the ping to get the pong that means that means it's working ping is there pong is, when it come with pong that means the redis cache is established perfectly then you can ready to go with the establishing the cache with the rest of the part in the like in the wordpress in the magento or somewhere else right so they have the different concept for uh, like uh, uh, connecting between both of them okay so now the redis cache is set up perfectly now we will check it's uh, working with the cache or not so we have we will going to set the cache so we will set this one set here you can also add the expiration of that milliseconds if you want right so it's okay now we are going to uh, now this value is set in the cache now we are going to get this value in from the cache so this you can see that so when we add the get test so it is already there in the redis cache so it is going to fetch it from here right you can see that now we will exit exist this one okay so we will come back from this one now we will going to restart and check the previous value is there or not we have restarted the redis cache and again we will go with the redis cli and let's check the previous 
data is there or not because we have restarted it so you can see that but still it's there right that means our redis cache is set up perfectly so any doubt any query in that just let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day